In this short video, papakita ko sa iyo kung ano nga ba ang BDO Equity Fund Review. Manatili lamang hanggang sa dulo ng video na ito dahil meron akong pamimigay sa iyo na makakatulong para sa pag-aaral mo tungkol sa mutual fund. But before we start, please subscribe, share, like, and comment. Ano nga ba ang BDO Equity Fund Review? BDO Equity Fund Review Investment Objectives The fund aims primarily for capital growth over medium to long term by investment in a selection of exchange-listed equities. The fund's benchmark is the Philippine Stock Exchange Composition Index, or PSEI. What are the BDO Equity Fund Top 10 Holdings? Number 1. SM Investments Number 2. SM Prime Number 3. Ayala Land Number 4. Ayala Corporation Number 5. BDO Unibank Number 6. Metrobank Number 7. Jollibee Foods Number 8. BPI Bank Number 9, ICTSI. And number 10, JG Summit. So, ang portfolio composition, 16% in financial, 31% in holding firms, 12% in industrial, 1% in mining and oil. 22% in property and 14% services and 4% in short-term deposit. So 96% purely on stocks and 4% in short-term deposits. So starting in May 3, 2005, so makikita natin Si BDO Equity, ni kulay blue. So, ang yellow naman ay ang PSE. So, started at 80 pesos. So, in Feb 28, 2019, so around 430. And mas higher siya sa ang performance kaysa sa PSEI index. So, cumulative performance as of February 28, 2019, BDO Equity Fund, first month is negative 2.81% and bench, benchmark of PSEI is negative 3.77%. In 3 years, BDO Equity Fund is 10.56% and for the PSEI is 15.51%. For the fund fact sheet, classification of the BDO fund equity fund is equity fund. Lunch day is May 3, 2005. For the minimum investment is 10,000 pesos. Minimum additional investment, 10,000 pesos. Minimum holding period is 30 calendar days. So net asset value per unit as of Feb 28 is 439 pesos. Total fund is 14.79 billion. Dealing period up to 2.30 p.m. of any banking day. Redemption settlement 4 banking days after the notice of redemption is received. So early redemption is 1% of original participation amount. Equity index fund review. Investment Objectives The fund aims to provide investors with a total return which reflects the return of the Philippine Stock Exchange Composite Index or PSEI by investing in a diversified portfolio of stocks that so far as practicable consists of the components companies of the PSEI. 
The funds benchmark is the Philippine Stock Exchange Composite Index or PSEI. What are BDO Equity Index Fund Top 10 Holdings? Number 1, SM Investments. Number 2, SM Prime. Number 3, Ayala Land. Number 4, Ayala Corporation. Number 5, BDO Unibank. Number 6, JG Summit. Number 7, BPI Bank. Number 8, Aboitis Equity. Number 9, Metro Bank. And number 10, Jollibee Foods. Portfolio composition, 17% in financial, 38% in holding firms, 12% in industrial, 1% in mining and oil, 21% in properties, 11% in, in services. So, 100% purely in stock investment, 0% in short-term deposits. So fund nabs versus benchmark and risk-free rate for the blue is BDO equity index fund and for the yellow line is PSE index. So it started in July 10, 2015. So makikita natin almost nagagaya niya ang PSE index so as of February 28, 2019 around 100 pesos ang net asset value per unit niya cumulative performance as of February 28, 2019 for BDO equity index fund in first month is negative 3.79% and for the PSEI is negative 3.77%. For three years, 14% ang BDO equity index fund. And for the PSEI is 15.51%. Fund fact sheet, classification niya is equity fund. Launch date is July 10, 2015. Minimum investment is 10,000 pesos and minimum additional investment is 10,000 pesos. Net asset value per share as of February 28, 2019 is 102 pesos. And total fund net asset value is 3.96.95.6 billion. Dealing period up to 2.30 p.m. of any banking day. For redemption settlement, four banking days after the notice of redemption is received. Early redemption fee is 0.50% of original participation amount. BDO ESG Equity Fund Review Investment Objectives The fund aims for long-term capital appreciation by substantially investing in listed companies which the trustee believes to exhibit good environmental, social, and governance ESG practices. The fund's benchmark is the Philippine Stock Exchange Composite Index, or PSEI. Environmental, social, and governance, or ESG, refers to the three main areas of consideration as key factors in measuring the sustainability and ethical impact of any investment in a company or business. Within these areas are broad set of concerns increasingly included in the non-financial factors that figures in the ter determination of a universe of investable outlets. ESG is the catch-all term for the criteria used in what has become known as socially responsible investing. What are BDO, ESG Equity Fund, Top 10 Holdings? Number 1, SM Investments. Number 2, SM Prime. 
Number 3, Ayala Corporation. Number 4, Ayala Land. Number 5, BDO Unibank. Number 6, GT Capital. Number 7, JG Summit. Number 8, Aboitis Equity. Number 9, Robinson's Land. And number 10, Metro Bank. Portfolio composition, 15% in financial, 38% in holding firms, 7% in industrial, 26% in properties, 10% in services, and 4% in short-term deposits. So almost 96% is purely in stocks and 4% in short-term deposits. Funds, net asset value per unit versus benchmark and risk-free rate. So here makikita ninyo BDO ESG equity fund is the blue, blue line and yellow is the PSE index and the the light blue is night treasury bills so it started in december 11 2015 started at 100 pesos so here makikita ninyo performance medyo mas maganda performance ni PSE index so as of february 28 2019 nasa 110 ang nabs per unit ni bdo ps So for cumulative performance naman, BDO ESG equity fund is negative 2.38% in the first month. For the benchmark, is PSEI is negative 3.77%. In 3 years, 16.32%. And for PSEI, benchmark is 15.51%. So makikita natin, mas maganda pa rin ang ROI ni BDO ESG Equity Fund for long term. So, fund pack, classification niya is Equity Fund. Launch date, December 11, 2015. Minimum investment is 10,000. Minimum additional is 10,000. Minim minimum holding periods is 30 calendar days. Net asset value per unit as of February 28, 2019 is 109 pesos. Total fund is 63.84 million. Dealing period is up to 2.30 p.m. of any banking day. Redemption settlement, 4 banking days after the notice of redemption is received. Early redemption is 1% of original participation. BDO Para Equity Fund review investment objectives the fund aims to achieve investment returns that track the performance of the philippine stock exchange index or psei by investing in a diversified portfolio of stocks the fund's benchmark is the philippine stock exchange composite index or psei what are BDO Pera Equity Index Fund Top 10 Holdings? Number 1 is SM Investment Number 2 SM Prime Number 3 Ayala Land Number 4 Ayala Corporation Number 5 BDO Unibank Number 6 JG Summit Number 7 BPI Bank Number 8 Aboitis Equity Number 9 Metro Bank and number 10, Jollibee Foods. Portfolio composition, 17% in financials, 38% in holding firms, 12% in industrial, 1% in mining and oil, 21% in properties, 11% in services, and 0% in short-term deposit. So purely 100% is in stock investments. So for the fund 
net asset value per unit versus the benchmark and this fee rate. So makikita natin ang blue line is BDO Para Equity Fund. The yellow line is the PSE index and the light blue is the treasury bill. So started in December 22, 2016 at 100 pesos. So here makikita natin almost mas maganda performance ni PSEI kaysa sa BDO Para Equity. And then at February 28, 2019, around 110 pesos ang unit per share ni BDO Para Equity. So cumulative performance ni BDO Para Equity Index Fund for the first month is negative 3.76%. For PSEI, is negative 3.77%. So, in one year, is negative 10.67% and negative 9.08% naman for the PSEI. For three years, not applicable since bago pa lang siya. So, fund pack classification niya is equity fund. Launch date is December 22, 2016. Minimum investment and additional is 10,000 pesos. 30, per, 30 calendar year for minimum holding period. So net asset value per unit is 110 as of February 28, 2019. So total fund for net asset value is 20.55 20 million. Dealing period is up to 2.30 p.m. for any banking day or redemption is 4 banking days. Early redemption fee is 1% of the original participation amount. BDO Focus Equity Fund Review Investment Objectives The fund aims to pursue long-term capital growth by investing in a concentrated portfolio of exchange-listed stocks, the selection of which shall be determined by the trustee based on operational performance, valuation, and market sentiment. The fund's benchmark is the Philippine Stock Exchange Composite Index, or PSEI. What are BDO Focus Equity Fund Top 10 Holdings? Number one is SM Investment. Number two, Ayala Corporation. Number three, Ayala Land. Number four, SM Prime. Number five is BDO Unibank. Number six, ICTSI. Number seven, Metro Bank. Number eight, BPI Bank. Number nine, Ayala's Global. And number ten is Pure Gold. Portfolio composition. 16% in financial, 31% holding firms, number 8% is industrial, 1% is mining and oil, 19% property, 16% services, and 9% in short-term deposits. So 91% purely stocks and 9% is short-term deposits. Funds net, net asset value per unit versus benchmark and risk-free rate. So here makikita natin, ang blue line is BDO Focus, Equity Fund. Yellow line is PSE Index and the light blue is Treasury Bills. So as of October 18, 2013, nag-start si BDO Focus ng 100 pesos. And then makikita natin, mas Magandang performance ni PSEI and nag-down siya as of February 28, 2019, around 90 pesos per unit. So as of February 28, 2019, cumulative performance ni BDO Fox Equity, first month is negative 2.27%. And PSEI is negative 3.77%. For 3 years, 
3.07% ROI ni BDO and for PSEI is 15.31%. So fund tax classification is equity fund. Launch date is October 18, 2013. Minimum investment is 10,000 and minimum additional investment is 10,000. Minimum holding period is 30 calendar days. Net asset value per unit as of February 28, 2019 is 91 pesos. Total fund of net asset value is 0.99 billion. Dealing period is up to 2.30 p.m. of any banking day. Redemption settlement is 4 banking days after the notice of redemption is received. And early redemption is 1% of original participation amount. BDO Institutional Equity Fund Review Investment Objectives The fund aims primarily for capital growth over the medium to long term by investing substantially in a selection of exchange-listed equities, Investments in bank deposit and other short-term fixed income instrument may be kept for liquidity and portfolio rebalancing purposes. The fund's benchmark is the Philippine Stock Exchange Composite Index or PSEI. What are BDO Institutional Equity Fund Top 10 Holdings? Number one is SM Investment. Number two is SM Prime. Number three, Ayala Land. Number four is BDO Uniba. Number five is Ayala Corporation. Number six, Jollibee Foods. Number seven is Metro Bank. Number eight is ICTSI. Number nine, Wilcom Depot. Number ten, Metro Pacific Investment. Portfolio composition, 13% in financial, 31% in holding firms, 17% in industrial, 1% in mining in oil, 22% in properties, 13% services, and 3% in short-term deposits. So 97% in stocks, and 3% is short-term deposits. Funds net asset value per, per unit versus benchmark and fees fee rate. So makikita ninyo is blue line is BDO, PSO Institutional Equity Fund. The yellow line is PSE Index and the light blue is the Treasury Bill Auction Rate. So here makikita natin nag-start siya at June 15, 2005. Amounting to 700, so makikita natin mas magandang performance siya kaysa sa PSE Index. So as of February 28, 2019, almost 5,200 per unit ang value na niya. Cumulative performance, BDO Institutional Equity Fund, for first month is negative 75%, for PSE is 3%. 0.77% for the first 3 years 15 15.01% ang ROI and for the PSEI is 15.51%. For the fund tax classification is equity fund launch date is June 15 2005. So minimum investment is 1000 pesos. Minimum additional investment is 1,000. Minimum maintaining participant is none. And minimum holding period is 30 calendar days. Net asset value per unit as of February 28, 2015 is 5,001 pesos. Total funds of net asset value is 9.4 billion. Dealing period is up to 2.30 p.m. of any banking day. 
Redemption settlement is 5 banking days after the notice of redemption is received. Early redem redemption fee is 0.50% of the original participation amount. BDO Sustainable Dividend Fund Review Investment Objectives The fund aims to achieve long-term capital appreciation by investing in a diversified portfolio of attractively price exchange listed stocks with sustainable dividend yields. The fund's benchmark is the Philippine Stock Exchange Comp Composite Index or PSEI. What are PDO Sustainable Dividend Funds? Top 10 Holdings Number 1. SM Investment Ayala Corporation SM Prime Ayala Land BDO Unibank Metrobank BPI Bank ICTSI Alliance Global Metro Pacific Investment Portfolio Composition 16% Financial 33% Holding Firms 9% Industrial 1% Mining and Oil 19% Property 17% Services and 5% Short-Term Deposit So 95% is invested in stocks and 5% is in short term deposits. So here makikita natin dito ang blue line is in BDO, yellow line ang PSE index and light blue ay ang 91-D T-bill auction rate. So here makikita natin from starting at 100 October 2013 and almost mas mataas na performance ni PSEI kaysa sa PDO Sustainable Dividend Fund as of February 29, 2019. So, community performance CBDO Sustainable Dividend Fund in the first month negative 1.92% PSEI negative 3.77% for 3 months 67 6.75% CBDO and CPSEI is 4.58% for 3 years BDO Sustainable Dividend Fund is 7.76% and for PSEI is 15.51%. So almost kalahati siya. Fund facts, classification, equity fund, launch date is October 18, 2013. Minimum investment is 10,000 and minimum additional is 10,000. Minimum holding period, 30 calendar days. So net asset value per unit. Is 105.63. Total NABS is 2.3 billion. And dealing period up to 2.30 p.m. of any banking day. Redemption settlement 4 banking days after the notice of redemption is received. Early, early redemption fee is 1% of original participation amount. To learn more about BDO Sustainable Dividend Fund, visit their website at www.bdo.com.ph slash personal slash trash dot dash n and dash investment. Thank you for watching my video. Please don't forget to subscribe, share, like, and comment.